This problem from AMC 8 2019 uses an idea from Menelaus theorem. And uh, if you are in our program, then you know that it is a major competency in the geometry focus area. So uh, look in the link, link in the description will take you to the knowledge graph page. And uh, this uh, particular picture that you see in the video is part of the knowledge graph that we use in mastering this particular problem. Okay, so uh, let's uh, look at the problem once and we will understand why each of these little pieces make up this problem. So we start with a triangle ABC and um, maybe I can draw it like this. It's usually a good idea to actually use a scalene triangle in the picture. And then uh, suppose take point D which is on the side AC such that AD is to DC is 1 is to 2. AD is to DC is 1 is to 2. And uh, let's join BD. Next, we look at the midpoint of BD, which is E. Join AE and produce it to meet BC at F. So this is the midpoint. So BE is given to be equal to ED. So all of this is given information. So AD over DC is equal to 1 is to 2 and B equals to ED. So given information. Okay, there is one more piece of information that is given and that's the area of triangle ABC which is given to be 360. With all this information, what is our goal? Our goal is to find the area of EBF, area of triangle EBF. And let's get back to the knowledge graph. We won't be discussing each piece of it. Of course, in the actual Chinta session, you will see each piece of this uh, puzzle. But um, all of these pieces will be very important in uh, solving this problem. So area of triangle and um, we have ratio of areas and basis of triangle. And we have the Menelaus theorem, which is also a pretty important part of the puzzle. In fact, this is the main competency uh, or the focus competency for this particular problem focus competency and uh, when we put all of these things together uh, we get back to the actual problem which is this one so as usual we want to go from problem to the concept so let's give it a try uh, so first uh, imagine this particular uh, maybe I can use the green color or actually let me use red this particular line a e f this line line in red as a transversal so we will be using uh, Menelaus theorem and Menelaus theorem requires the notion of transversal cutting through a triangle if you do not know Menelaus theorem you can go to the link in the description and check what it is now you look at this particular triangle in golden or yellow maybe and you, you see this DA as produced, uh, CD produced. So imagine DA as CD produced. So you see AEF as a transversal to this yellow triangle. So now applying Menelaus theorem, we can say that CA, okay, maybe I can just put it a little bit up. Okay, CA over AD times DE over EB times BF 
over fc is equal to 1. Well, that's the fact using Menelaus theorem. If you do not know this, that's fine. You can go to the link in the description and check. All right. So, uh, so we know the value of CA over AD. We already know that. This is 3 over 1. Because if this is 1 is to 2, then this, this entire thing, CA over AD, is 3 is to 1. Okay, and we also know DE over EB is just 1 is to 1 because both of them are equal. E is given to be the midpoint. And finally, we do not know BF over FC, so we want to find that. That's equal to 1. So BF over FC turns out to be 1 over 3. So this is 1 is to 3, this particular piece. Okay. So that part is pretty much simple. It's a straightforward ap application of Menelaus theorem. Next, we want to use the fact that the area of triangle ABC is 360. So we know, and this is the, again, coming back to the second um, piece of the knowledge graph. And this is a very important piece actually, that ratio of area or and basis of triangle, the relationship between them. So in particular, if you have two, two triangles, maybe I can use two different colors. If you have two triangles, which are standing on the same baseline, maybe the same baseline, and sharing a vertex, so they both have the same vertex. So maybe the triangle is ABC and AXY. Then their areas, area of triangle ABC over area of triangle AXY is equal to the ratio of their bases, BC over XY. This follows from the uh, area, area of triangle formula, which is also a pretty important competency. But um, so we will be using this fact quite readily. So let's do that. Uh, in particular, we know using this, and you can give it a try, using this we know that ABD, which is this piece, ABD over BCD is equal to 1 is to 2. Now, entire thing is 360, it is divided into 1 is to 2 portions. So the top one must be 120 and the bottom one must be 240. That should be the area of each of these pieces. So in particular, this white thing that we have, area of that is 120. And this point AE, in fact, this line AE divides it into exactly two equal parts as far as e area is concerned. Why? We again use this fact that BE is equal to ED. So, in particular, this portion in blue, that is half of 120, which is 60. So, the portion in blue is 60. Alright. Now, we can again apply the same idea. Maybe I can just make some room here. We can apply the same idea of ratio of areas of triangles to triangle ABF and ACF. So triangle ABF and triangle ACF. And that's 1 is to 3 because that's, that, that's what we found using the Menelaus theorem. B of is to AC is that. And together, these two pieces again make 360 because that's a total triangle. So in particular, ABF must be 90. It's one fourth of the entire triangle and total triangle is 360. Okay. So then the final lap, 
this full thing is 90 that's the area the blue portion the area of the blue portion we computed it to be 60 therefore this green portion which is our target that must be 30 the remaining one so this is just a sketch of course uh, in the actual class we should uh, we will be going we generally go through each of these pieces so uh, uh, keeping our eye on the main focus competency which is the Menelaus theorem and uh, a link in the description will take you to more ideas like this uh, it's always a good idea to actually master a problem uh, using a knowledge graph then you exactly see what's going on so um, give it a try and we will be back in the next problem thank you for watching